And there's the bell. Oh, Michael, this is going to be fun to watch. Booker T shows us some clever offense here. Don't expect a lot of mercy to be shown here. Yeah, none expected and none will be shown. That shot hit the opponent exactly in the right spot. What accuracy. Now, and he's still in this. Booker T, who began his career in Texas, moved to WCW, where he held every WCW championship as a tag team and singles competitor. Booker was also a decorated WWE champion, while being the 2006 King of the Ring and general manager of SmackDown. You know, Michael, Booker's won championship gold everywhere he's ever competed. Don't forget, he was a commentator on SmackDown and part of the 2013 WWE Hall of Fame induction class. Now, can you dig that sucker? It's tough to top Booker's resume. Here's somebody who's willing to do just about anything to get to the top. I like it. That's the way it should be. We'll have our third competitor momentarily. Is he, is he out? No, he made it back in. When you look at the path, Booker... And he's still in this. Why is the guy his opponent and what's he going for here? Time for another superstar to join the match. I wouldn't be in any hurry to get down to that ring. It's not a race, you know. Oh, that can't feel good. Look how slow he is to recover here. That was some serious punishment. These guys are giving it their all here tonight, not just to entertain the fans, but to ultimately walk away with the win. Is he is he out? No, he made it back in. Look at this now. Many people feel that Booker T was the breakout star of all the talent that came to WWE from the old... Oh, he's coming back in. Is it time already? That was fast. Well, here comes many people's pick to win this thing. The human body can only absorb so much of that. So much on the line in this one. And like they say, on any given night, anything can happen in WWE. That's something I learned early on in my stay here in the WWE. Yeah, but like tonight I beat you. Yeah, absolutely anything can happen in the WWE. Even that. Hilo Brown is locked up. Superstar has entered the match. Well, Michael, this guy's been telling anybody that would listen that he's going to win this thing. Well, buddy, here's your chance. You know, once you hear Booker T's music and his famous question, you know he's going to come to the ring and put on a show like no other. Booker's going to fight hard. He's going to bring the crowd to a roar, and he's going to hit a famous spinner Rooney. I don't like how slow he is to react right now. On him. Is he is he out? No, he made it back in. Still down after that move. I almost wonder if his bell got seriously rung there. And he fails to connect with anything that time. Man, that was some miss, all right. I can feel the breeze all the way over here. Well, a very impressive thing is, oh, he's coming back in. Few superstars are as dominant as this guy. What a shot. If you take many more like that, you're going to resemble an out. Big Show could have this match in the bag. Wow, that was a wild strike. Talking about missing the target. Yeah, it looked like it was completely out of desperation. And there's the toss. Oh, that was close. He's coming back through the ropes. He's got him hooked. Here's another competitor. And look at him, Michael. He looks determined to win this match. Oh, he's coming back in. That strike hit the spot. There's no way he could have avoided that blow. Let's 
Let's just hope Big Boss Man's stamina can hold up. For those history buffs watching tonight, it's worth noting that D'Lo Brown was WWE's first ever Euro Continental Champion. And Big Boss Man nails it. Oh, this may very well end. Astonishing maneuver by Booker T. Look how slow he is to recover here. That was some serious punishment. I don't know what's going to happen here. He's fought out of it. Concentrating on the arm now. Oh, no. Wait a minute. He's still in this one. He's fought out of it. What a brutal way to take someone off their feet. You got to be kidding me. Yeah, that was quite the slam, wasn't it, Cole? Oh, no. Big show with the opening. Well, D'Lo Brown was the first ever Euro Continental Champion. One title he never held during his run in the 1990s and early 2000s was the Tag Team Championship. Despite a very successful pairing with his Nation of Domination partner, the Godfather. And they pushed him out. They got Goldust been taken out. of WWE's best vying to walk out victorious here tonight. That wild strike found nothing but empty air that time. <laughs> Man, that's what you call swinging for the fences and missing. He's in big trouble. Looking highly motivated here. All these power moves tonight are making bigger and bigger impacts. And that'll give you a negative attitude. Big Show finding a path of destruction currently. A major day in history for Big Show and WWE was the 1999 St. Valentine's Day Massacre pay-per-view. That marked the WWE debut of the Big Show when he was still called by his real name, Paul White. He came up through the ring mat and attacked Stone Cold Steve Austin during his match with Mr. McMahon. Oh, Michael, when Big Show debuted in WWE during St. Valentine's Day Massacre, it was a chaotic night. He actually tore through the mat to get at Stone Cold Steve. Is he, is he out? No, he made it back in. Oh, boy. Boss Man got hurt there. This is a level of destruction no one was expecting. No kidding. This is getting ugly. Jerry, Big Show's WWE debut was amazing. The seven-foot-two monster began launching Steve Austin into the steel cage. He threw Steve Austin like a dart right out of the cage. There was never a debut like that before or after in WWE history. Oh, he's coming back in. Taken down with a beautiful suplex. See what kind of response we'll get. Yeah, I'm telling you, that suplex was perfect. And Booker's done here. It just wasn't Booker's night, Cole. A wild overhead punch wreaking havoc in here. No kidding, that shot came out of nowhere. You know, Cole, we've talked about it. And the Big Show's WWE debut is definitely one of the... And he's still in this. When it strikes land, you can feel it in the first few rows. Sometimes the best offense is a great defense, and that's exactly what we're seeing here. Look out what's going on here. He's delivering an old-fashioned butt-kicking right here. He's still in this one. What's he gonna do here? What's he gonna do here? We've got a fresh superstar entering the match. Yeah, and you know, Michael, being fresh is a huge advantage in a match like this. How many times have we seen Big Show get on a roll like he's on now? And then moments later, his arms and Dusty Rhodes getting it done. A uh, very impressive, Big Dust. Oh, resounding move by Big Show. Good Lord, that wasn't even close. So that's what it's like being so far off the mark. If you haven't done it yet, check out WWE.com. Oh, he's coming back in. DDP is still dizzy, and he's still in this. 
Wow, that was a wild strike. Talk about missing the target. Yeah, it looked like he was completely out of desperation. Well, that missed him all right. Hey, did you look before firing? What an idiot. Why is the guy his opponent? What's he going for here? And Edge is done. Not going to win many matches with that move. Whoa! A direct hit. Talk about getting tagged and knocked in the middle of next week. He's fought out of it. Big Show is gone. Oh, wow. That was as impressive of an elimination as I've ever seen. When this big monster gets a hold of you, it is lights out. Oh, that was close. And Farouk nails it. How much damage did that do? A lot from the looks of it. Going for the double play with this move. These are great competitors, great, tremendous gladiators here in WWE. Some of the best superstars the WWE have to offer. Boss Man is out of this contest. Billy Gunn looking in top physical condition as always. Billy Gunn has found an answer here. Man, oh man, did he take a wild swing with that one. You're right. That was wild indeed. Good thing we're over here. Now, who does a methodical pace benefit, King? Well, I'll tell you, whenever the dominating competitor takes his time, it gives everybody a chance. And that's it for Farouk. You know, Diamond Dallas, and he's still in this. Looking to build momentum. Here comes another superstar. Oh, man. I hope they reinforce the ring for this one. Wow. What a move from Dusty Rhodes. That's how you make this crowd stand on its feet, Cole. Look at him. Extra slow getting back to his base here. Can't stay vertical after the belly to belly suplex. One of the best moves ever to take your opponent off his feet. Barely any damage has been inflicted so far, but this one's not over yet. Before kicking his in-ring career off at 35 years of age, DDP was an accomplished manager, starting his career in Minnesota in Vern Gagne's AWA. Among the greats that he went on to manage, the fabulous free... He's fought out of it. I don't think DDP knows where he is. Each and every one of these 30 superstars think they have what it takes to win this one. And that's the attitude you have to have. Otherwise, you're going to be in big trouble. And he's still in this. Oh, man, that's it for DDP. Oh, no, Dusty Rhodes with the opportunity. And he'll take it. Here we go. This could be it. No, oh, wait. Nice recovery. Look out, there's a target on that bat. Great offense by Christian. You can see him struggling to stand after all the damage he's taken. I gotta tell you, these guys are in the... And that partnership got the Jericho's been eliminated. Very impressive. He's been waiting for his chance to enter, and here it is. Oh, Cole, this guy has a legitimate chance of winning this thing. Of WWE. And the collaboration work. Cactus Jack is through. 
You know, sometimes newer superstars need a little time to get comfortable with their surroundings before they really make a name for themselves. But not Christian. Oh, that was close. He's coming back through the ropes. Christian's in trouble. We're looking at complete domination here. Oh, man. How do you stand after an attack like this? The British Bulldog may even be more powerful than he looks. Some very opportunistic offense here. Oh, he missed. Oh, nobody home that time. Oh, my. That phased him. I mean, there's no way it couldn't have. Since that light heavyweight championship victory you brought up earlier, Christian has gone on to accomplish some amazing feats here in WWE, including revolutionizing the tag team scene with his partner Edge. Their TLC matches in the early 2000s were so historic. Yeah, but Michael, Christian isn't just a tag team specialist. Here's a guy who's won nearly every singles title there is to win in the WWE, including the World Heavyweight Championship, when he beat Alberto Del Rio. Oh, he's coming back in. We've got a fresh superstar entering the match. And you know, Michael, being fresh is a huge advantage in a match like this. Timber, and he falls hard. Good Lord, that wasn't even close. So that's what it's like being so far off the mark. Look out. The American dream is out. I can't believe it, Cole. Christian in trouble. Hey, is it me? Or does Brian Pillman get crazier each time we see him? Talk about unpredictable. And the clock hits zero. Here comes a Another superstar. Oh wow, this changes everything. This is a wreck. He's moving like an uncaged animal. Oh my, he's wild in there. Uh-oh. And he just found out that's not the place you want to be. Not ever, never. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. Here comes the new favorite, Mark Henry. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damage rip, getting some air here. I need some too after sitting next to you. Bulldog on the attack. The Bulldog is on fire tonight. We're gonna see a is he is he out? No, he made it back in. Oh, I think this man means business. Oh, and he missed that one. God, that's got to hurt. Yeah, you're not doing any damage with swings like that, but keep doing it. He's still in this one. As this continues, it's harder and harder to catch your breath. Yeah, that'll take the wind out of your sails. Adding insult to potential injury there. He's in full-on attack mode now. A systematic attack here. We're looking at complete domination here. Oh, no. Wait a minute, Cole, what's he gonna do here? And the turnbuckle does the damage. That's it, he's done. Oh, wow, he is just getting busted up. Ow, ooh. Wow, he's still down after that. Well, King, getting back to your earliest assessment of Brian Pillman's sanity, I'd have to agree. There's certainly a screw loose upstairs. You know, you don't earn the loose cannon moniker by accident. You guys are nuts. Brian Pillman isn't crazy. He knows exactly what he's doing. He's making all of you fear him, thinking he's going to go off the deep end. And if you ask me, the guy's a genius.
look past the ring at the thousands and thousands of WWE fans in attendance. Each and every one of them are having a great time tonight. Oh, you're right about that. You are. Is he? Is he out? No, he made it back in. This might be big. Gonna feel that breaker in the morning. And there's the reversal from Brian Pillman. Between his stints as a professional foot. Oh, he's coming back in. He's showing no signs of letting up. He's still in this one. Well executed offense. Look out below. Look at him, Michael. I mean, those moves have really stuck. Oh, that was close. He's coming back through the rope. The rolling neck snap. Oh, my. The end is near. Did you hear the neck snap? You have to wonder what's going through. And he's still in this. We may have discovered his favorite move. You think? He seems to use it often enough. So long, British Bulldog! He may be in the best physical condition I've ever seen him in. And Hillman has been eliminated. God, there was nothing accurate about that attempt at offense. Mark Henry delivers the headbutt on all fours, and we're done. No kidding, what a vicious headbutt. Mark Henry should win this. Are we gonna see it? Nobody home there. Nobody home? Oh, oh, Mr. Perfect is out of this contest. Cole, if you ask me, Bret Hart's sharpshooter is right up there with Ric Flair's figure four, or even Stone Cold Stunner, and all the other iconic finishers from over the years. The tension, the drama, this is electric. Look at the back of my arm, Cole. Look at the goosebumps. I love this. Man, he's Now, fresh superstar has just entered the match. A huge advantage for the newcomer. A huge advantage indeed. And there goes Christian's hopes of winning this one. You know, it just didn't seem like Christian was on his game tonight. These are great competitors, great, tremendous gladiators here in WWE. Some of the best superstars that WWE have to offer. Is he, is he out? No, he made it back in. Here's another competitor. And look at him, Michael. He looks determined to win this match. pretty about that. Now, who does a methodical pace benefit, King? Well, I'll tell you, whenever the dominating competitor takes his time, it gives everybody a chance to catch their breath. And there's the reversal for Bret Hart. Get ready, folks! Get ready! He's got him! Here's the moment he's been waiting for. I'll tell you, I wouldn't be surprised if he was... Oh, he's coming back in. Cole, what you got in mind? Oh, that was close. He's coming back through the ropes. I don't remember the last time he executed that maneuver. Oh, wow! What a maneuver! I don't see how anyone can recover from that. What force! First time for everything, I guess. It's got to be history. Is he still even conscious? Oh, man. Oh, oh what a shot. That did some serious damage. He's still in this one. Uh-oh, the back of the head just bounced off the mat with that slam. Kane's coming to the ring. Yeah, when Kane gets to the ring, there's going to be some serious trouble. Trying to build. Is he, is he out? No, he made it back in. 
Man, oh man, did he take a wild swing with that one. You're right. It's an early exit for Lex Luger. Man, I for one, Michael, did not see that coming. Now that's the type of move, and he's tripled up. Bret Hart's sharpshooter certainly is iconic. And what makes it even more impressive is that he can put it on literally any... That's it for Ken Shamrock. A sickening thud as his body is driven to the mat. I don't know how much more damage he can take. Kane is in trouble. Ouch! After a move like that, he's going to need to see a chiropractor or a spine specialist, whatever he's coupled with. No pun intended, of course. Yeah, he's not going to be comfortable for a while. It's scary to think we first saw Kevin Nash as Shawn Michaels' bodyguard, the giant Diesel. It's surreal to be sitting here tonight at ringside with the bird's eye view of this powerhouse punishing anything that moves. Okay, Kevin Nash has had major rivalries here in WWE. One of them I remember like it was yesterday. For his matches with Chris Jericho, Jericho's versatile style against opponents of any size made this extra intense. I mean, Nash made sure he used his power and pushed Jericho to the absolute limit. Yeah, Cole, I remember that rivalry, too. I also remember calling the matches on Raw, and you're right, they were heated. I think the two may have had some unresolved issues from their days in WCW. But if they didn't have differences before, they sure did when they stepped in a WWE ring. That's And that'll be all for Mark Henry. If his back wasn't hurt before, it certainly is now. And it's going to be hurting for a while. The rivalry between Kevin Nash and Chris Jericho reminded some people of the matches Nash had earlier in his career against Shawn Michaels. The Nash-Jericho matches were so physical. And with Jericho, Nash always had to look over his shoulder because an attack could come from literally anywhere. Oh, that was close. He's coming back through the road. Ridiculous maneuver by Kevin Nash. Each and every one of these 30 superstars think they have what it takes to win this one. And that's the attitude you have to have. Otherwise, you're going to be in big trouble. It's Jake the Snake Roberts! Oh, Michael, you talked about the Nash-Jericho rivalry, and you're right. The matches were physical, intense, and you always have to watch what the heck Chris Jericho is going to do next. If you don't believe me, just watch the hair versus hair match they had on Raw from 2003. I know Kevin Nash remembers that one. And he's still in this. Look out. Jim the Anvil Nightheart on the offensive. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Oh, that was close. He's coming back through the ropes. He's trying to mangle his face here. This might be big. Is it time already? That was fast. Well, here comes many people's pick to win this thing. The rope Oklahoma slam. So long, partner. Yeah, adios, amigo. You know, for a minute to thug. I hear Kama Mustafa has a bit of a way with the ladies. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here. That's a he's fought out of it. We're looking at complete domination here. Quick thinking to avoid that. And Kane manages to reverse out of that one. That back's got to be aching now. You have to possess a different type of focus to punish an opponent like this. Yeah, you really have to enjoy hurting someone. Nearly driven through the mat. King, I heard the same thing you did about Kama Mustafa. It's odd. I wouldn't expect a guy with such a no-nonsense tough exterior to be a ladies' man. What are you talking about? Just because a guy... And he's still in this! Another superstar is about to join the match. You know what? We might just be looking at the next WrestleMania main eventer.
Look at the attack here. Oh, man. Talk about a direct hit. Get ready, folks. Get ready. Oh, Honky Tonk Man going in. He's in big trouble. Is he, is he out? No, he made it back in. When he gets going like this, there are few better. Well, you can bet Honky Tonk Man would like to land his patented shake, rattle, and roll here pretty soon. There he is, the short arm clothesline. Vintage shake the snake. Well, that messed him all right. Hey, did you look before firing? What an idiot. I'm not sure if he knows where he is right now. Look out, there's a target on that back. Oh, he's in trouble now. What intensity. Bam, bam, Bigelow being pressed hard. We're looking at complete domination here. He's inflicting some serious pain. Well, it'll take a minor miracle to come back from this. Bam Bam Bigelow's night has come to an end. Well, bye-bye, Bam Bam. Uh-oh. Here we go again. Look out. When this guy's... And he's still in this. What's going to happen now? Well, they couldn't find a home for that one. Well, it certainly wasn't due to a going to end it with the arm twist leg lariat. If you think that doesn't hurt, you're wrong. What's he going to do here? What's he going to do here? You could call this a good old-fashioned butt whooping. Yeah, that's exactly what we're witnessing. A butt whooping. Oh, he's coming back in. Honky Tonk Man actually short. And Kevin Nash makes him pay in the worst way on that exchange. You know, a superstar definitely needs a strategy if they're going to be facing Kevin Nash. And personally, I think the strategy needs to be take out a leg. If you can somehow get the big man down, that'll take away some of that power. And it might also make it difficult for Nash to stand up and nail you with that jackknife powerbomb. And Honky Tonk Man gets taken down. You know, we're clearly not witnessing Honky Tonk Man's greatest moment right here. Wow, that was a wild strike. Talk about missing the target. Yeah, it looked like it was completely out of desperation. And that shot was dialed in. Look out for Kane! There can only be... That's it for the Hockey Talk, man. Couldn't happen to a better man. Jerry, you mentioned a strategy against Kevin Nash, and I think going Kevin Nash is gone. Well, Nash was really pushed to the limit here tonight. This is a wreck. He's moving like an uncaged animal. No lie, he's wild in there. What a match this is going to be. I've been looking forward to this one for a long time, Cole. And the clock hits zero. Here comes another superstar. Oh, wow, this changes everything. Look out, here comes the snake. Jake is so methodical in picking apart his opponents that sometimes we forget how fast he can be when lighting them up. Like what we're seeing right now. Is Damian moving? I'd check that bag. Well, and he's still in this. An impressive backbreaker there. The action is fast and furious here in this colossal 30-person contest. And he fails to connect with anything that time. Man, that was some miss, all right. I could feel the breeze all the way over here. He's fought out of it. Uh-oh, what's this? 
X-Pac in all kinds of trouble. Well, Kane has been taken out of the equation. You know, I really thought there was going to be no stopping Kane tonight. You're right, King. I've even seen X-Pac hit the X-Factor from the top rope. Yeah, and there's no getting up from a top rope X-Factor. The impact's just too much to overcome, Cole. X-Pac on the attack! Jake Roberts has sustained just awful blows during this match. How oh! oh, man! A big-time miss! His midsection taking a lot of damage here. Looking fresh out there, you're not going to lose many matches when you're competing at full health. Is he, is he out? No, he made it back in! I don't think there's an area on that back that's not suffering right now. Yeah, when he wakes up in the morning, the only thing on his body that's not going to hurt is his pajamas. You know, most guys can only dream of going undefeated for a whole year. But not Andre the Giant. He went an astonishing 15 years without losing a match. Can you imagine that? 15 years. He's still in this one. Man, Andre the Giant, what offense. Look at this. He's going back to an old friend with that one. <laughs> You're right. And we're down to the final three competitors. Uh-oh. Oh, man. How do you beat an opponent that can do that to you? Andre's unbelievable undefeated streak is only a portion of his story. Here's a guy who's also won the WWE Championship, World Tag Team Championship, and was the first ever inductee into the WWE Hall of Fame. I don't think anybody would argue that Andre the Giant is the greatest big man of all time. As a matter of fact, he's so great, Michael, that he has his... And they pushed him. Ladies and gentlemen, Andre the Giant's been eliminated. Oh, my gosh, I can't believe my eyes, Cole. He's in full attack mode now. And he's still in this. Oh, that was close. He's coming back through the ropes. One move after the other. It's devastating. This is hard to watch. This is going to be bad. All these power moves tonight are making bigger and bigger impacts. No breathing room here for X-Pac. with a nice reversal. Man, X-Pac, what offense. What great action we've had in this match. I'm absolutely loving it, Cole. Come on, aren't you? Look how excited you are. one a fever pitch is here in the WWE universe you're right about that the crowd is buzzing they're ready for this thing to get underway Got to be careful not to take on too much more damage here. You know what I think of X-Pac? Is he, is he out? No, he made it back in! Uh-oh. What's this? X-Pac in all kinds of trouble.
I'll tell you, Jake Roberts is showing no mercy in this onslaught. This guy's kicks are so impactful. Gonna have to compartmentalize some of the pain that's been dished out and find a way to forge on. Taking a bit of a beating so far, but nothing that can't be overcome. of WWE's best vying to walk out victorious here tonight. I just can't get over the physicality of this match. This has been brutal. Brutal and very, very painful for these guys. Ah, the rope atomic drop. Ooh, that was brutal. And it was not a good night for X-Pac. What a victory! What a match! Here's your winner, Jay the Snake Roberts! Quite some back and forth there before finally picking up the win. And you could tell it took every ounce of energy in that body to pick up that last elimination. Very nicely done. A spectacular rumble. What a victory!